all welcome back to my channel I'm here today to do a Tuesday morning haul uh, this may be probably will be the last haul I don't think I'll be going back in there um, as you may well know they're all closing so unfortunately I won't have my Tuesday morning anymore but I did go into the checkout uh, to see what they had left I went to two different ones um, the second one I went to I found this and um, I've been looking for a cutting mat for this table that's right here. As a matter of fact, you're looking at it. And this was actually perfect. Uh, I like the fact that it's got the, um, the uh, measurements for card bases, which is going to help. And uh, basically, you can do anything on here. Um, you can use it for glue. You can use it for cutting. You can use it for just about anything. So this is what it looks like, and um, you know it's got all the measurements on here. It's a 13 by 9 cutting surface, and it's got all those uh, guides and everything on here. So yeah, this is uh, I thought this was a good deal. Plus uh, everything is an additional 10 percent off, unless of course it's on clearance. So then. Um, if it's on clearance, obviously it's going to be higher, but everything on the store is 10% additional off, I believe. So I also picked this up. Uh, it just says uh, it's $4.99 regularly, I think $9.99. Here it says $14.99, I don't know. This is by uh, Momenta. And I really didn't know they made cardstock, to be honest with you. I just thought they made dyes. <laughs> Because that's dyes and stamps and embossing folders. But um, let me show you really quick what's in here. They're all single sided and there's really pretty watercolor papers in here. So they have some nice papers in here. And for $5, and this is uh, three of each uh, design, there's 16 designs in here. It's an 8x8. And the paper is pretty thick. I, I would say it's like, I don't know, maybe 65, 80. I mean, it's not heavy, heavy paper, but uh, for layering weight, it's pretty good. And then the other thing I found while I was there was this. This is called a stamp store and go with tray. Um, so I do have a bunch of, I don't have many wood stamps, but I do have a bunch of them and I want to organize them. So this, this is what I picked this up for. And this was $7.49 uh, regularly, I guess $14 says on there, $15. And it's an additional 10% off of that. So there's that. And then in the other store, um, this is what I picked up. I got the, uh, let me get this out of the way. I have the, uh, 6x6 six six in this collection. This is the, uh, Essentials Kit. It's a 12x12. 12 12. This is homegrown. And I have the, uh, paper pad. And because this is Essentials, I just think this is great, uh, paper just to go with all those other papers I have. So I picked that up. And it does come with the uh, journal bits and the uh, bits and pieces. And then it has a sticker sheet. And so it says $12.99 regularly. I guess it says $29.99. And plus 10% off of that. So I picked this up. This is so hanging with my heifers. <laughs> I love this collection. So I did get this. Real, real pretty. So let me take it out so we can look at it real quick. Okay, so you get this paper right here. Here's the other side. Love these chickens. <laughs> This is great for cutting out strips. I love that pig. Look at that, so cute. 
That is so cute. I love that. Look at this. Real pretty. And then you get all these uh, seed packets. So you can either come apart or just use them the way they are. And here's the other side of that, which is basically a lined um, paper. It's like a receipt. Got the name of that on there. Very cute. Look at these flowers. Love, love, love these flowers. Look how pretty this print is. Okay, you get the, the cow print. Oops. Oh, that's it. And you get this really pretty wood grain on here. You get this gingham. And you get all these. This kind of reminds me of uh, Country Kitchen. I have a Country Kitchen. A piece. I was working with that recently and um, I have a strip that looks exactly like that which is really and that's by Cardabella too interesting but it looks like that. then you got these cut apart tags love you till the cows come home that's so cute I like like peas in a pod made with lots of love you're extra special hey there love you fresh you are my sunshine so very sweet hugs and kisses live love farm and the other side you got the other side of the tags on there look how pretty the flowers are you got these color parts here great for journaling this is so pretty i love this plaid love the colors in here here's some more color parts just love like someone left the gate open. That's so cute. Locally grown, 100% organic. Eggs, local fresh. Home is where my herd is. <laughs> Tomato, early girl. Country life and farmer's market. Very, very cute images on here. Here's this one. More cut aparts. Love these vegetables. So cute. Look at this. Oh, I love this. So cute. Perfect card. That'd be such a great card. And the sticker sheet. And you get all these sentiments down here, too. And you got these really pretty stickers. So that is for that. And then, um,. I figured, well, why not? So I picked up the chipboard for that collection, homegrown, and then I found the puffy sheet. Did I say puffy sheet? Puffy stickers. <laughs> so point. So cute. Cockadoodle do. Farmers markets. Farmer. Oops. Very very cute. I picked up the brads, the decorative brads for that collection. And I, let me see, I think that's it. Yeah, that's it. So these other pieces have nothing to do with this collection. The only thing I didn't have, I guess, was the chipboard uh, frame. Okay. So this collection is called the Let's Celebrate Collection. These are chipboards. Frames. I thought these would be cute to make shaker cards out of, and they're all birthday type celebration. And these are all the ones that come in there. And you get six in here. There were three by four and four by six. Very very cute. And then I found these stencils. By Simple Stories, I found this one called um, 
What's this one? P Butterfly Garden. It's a six by eight stencil. Very cute, very pretty. And then I found this one called Summer Lovin'. I know they have the collection, but I just wanted the stencil on that. They're like these uh, very 60s, I want to say, uh, type of image. I don't know what I'm thinking of. I'm thinking about those flowers or something like that that you have. Um, I think that's what I think. It's called Retro Daisy. Okay, there you go. Retro Daisy, that's why I was thinking um, retro, because it's definitely called Retro Daisy. Very cute. And that's it for Tuesday morning. If I go back out there, I'll definitely share that. But at this time, I don't think that's going to happen. But um, we'll see. Okay. Uh, if you like this video, give me a thumbs up. And uh, if you have any questions or comments, just leave them down below. And I will talk to you later. Have a great day. Bye now.